suppose the, the big question is, the, the Cheetahs season is finished and we're October 31st, we're ahead of the charges. But um, when does planning for season 2024 start? About three, four weeks, three, four weeks ago. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I mean, we've always said that, you know, obviously when the season finishes, we start sort of looking at things regarding riders and one thing and another and analysing what happened during the season and uh, seeing what we can work with and what we can't work with. So there's quite a lot involved, um, you know, but, uh, you know, we had, we had a great season, you know, I, I can't really fault any of them. Yeah. So, uh, you know, I'm really pleased with the outcome at the moment and, uh, you know, we just have to wait on the point limit. Yeah. But, you know, it's, um, that's always unfortunate every year. You're going to have to lose someone. Yeah. But I've got a rough idea in mind which way we're going to go for next season. And it won't be a million miles away from what we've done right now. So, uh, so I'm really pleased. Yeah. Now, you mentioned the word point limit. People won't effectively understand this. Um, now, I'm going to use an analogy that if people are football fans, they might play fantasy football. Mm -hmm. And they're given £20 million to build a squad. It's a little bit similar for you because you'll get a point limit of which you've got to fit all your riders into. So if somebody averages a fantastic average, that is taken off, I think it's around about 42, 43, is it? Uh, it no, the, the, the point limit this year was 40. 40. Yeah. So if you put a rider in yeah. that is giving you 10 points, yeah. the other riders have got to fit in 30. Yeah, yeah you've got 30 to play with, yeah, exactly. So bear in mind, you know, that you came into this season with the cheaters with people screaming at you whilst looking at the green sheet averages which is what everybody looks at saying you're too top heavy yeah. um and from a very naive point of view it's not the sort of the scott nichols is and the, the bomber harris is they they've had years behind them so their average is pretty solid it's finding the right people to improve on their average isn't it that was the key this year you know uh, the whole reason why we run the charges, for instance, is I'm very much into progression. Yeah. You know, and when you actually look at the history this year, how we use the team, you know, we've done everything in house. Mm -hmm. So we almost had like a squad system. Yeah. So when we had a couple of injuries, I always filled them in with riders from the charges, for instance, you know, knowing that they're probably not quite ready yet. Yeah. But they need to have this opportunity to be able to, 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 to find the goal where they want to get to. So, and I'm sort of a great believer if we don't look after the youth, the sport will not survive. Correct. You can't just go out and keep shopping all the time yeah. and keep buying. Yeah. You know, you have to work, you have to sort of build your sort of uh, foundations if you like. And we've managed to do that at Oxford in a very short period of time. Yeah. You know, and that's what we're really proud of. Mm -hmm. You know, for instance, you've got a Henry Atkins who yeah. came in, you know, at the time Henry was ready to retire, you know, because he got uh, uh, sort of shifted from pillar to post yeah. in other teams and one thing and another. And, yeah. and, you know, started doing well and then suddenly the team made changes and yeah. took him out. And, you know, I wasn't going to go down that route. So we've, we've created something where he's coming on a 2.3 average, for instance, yeah. nearly ended up on a 5 point average, yeah. you know, which is which is phenomenal really for him, you know, and, and uh, the same with Jordan Jenkins, yeah. you know, is they needed those three riders in Sam Masters, Scott Nichols and uh, Louis Kerr yeah. to be able to, you know, we needed to build that buffer for these boys. Yeah. So, uh, you know, as we all expect of the top riders, 10 points plus, yeah. so the way I look at it, you know, you're looking at uh, uh, 30 odd points there already. Got to find then 16 points. Find 16 points, you win the match. Yeah. You know, and if you can't get 16 points between the other four, then you have got a problem. Yeah. You know, but we managed to sort of really work that. And, um, you know, it showed in all the aggregate points what we picked up everywhere else, you know, and as far as I'm concerned, uh, never mind about the playoffs. Yeah. We finished second in the league with a team yeah. which nobody gave me any chance. Yeah. You know, so, so I'm quite. Put everything else aside in the season, that is one thing we're really proud of here, what we've done.